Hey guys, it's Marty Bila for CoolCleveland.com. We're here at First Unitarian Church in Shaker Heights, and we're talking about some sustainability today and some spirituality. And we're here today with Ursuline's Liz Meacham. How are you, Liz? I'm doing great. Thanks. That's great. And how are you, Reverend Daniel Bud? Very good. Thank you. Oh, that's awesome. And we're talking about first, let's start off with the sustainability and spirituality program that's new to Ursuline. It's a unique topic. Tell us a little bit about it, Liz. Well, there's really a global movement of change towards sustainability, and more is going on than people even imagine or know or understand. I bet. And, of course, we have a huge amount going on in Cleveland. Uh, religious organizations and spirituality are a big part of sustainability on the planet at this time, and I think it's really important for more people to learn about that, learn how to become leaders in that movement. And I wanted to feature First Unitarian because they're really leaders in our community right here in Northeast Ohio for sustainability. I agree. I totally agree. I've seen some stuff today and it's amazing. And if you guys are interested in the topic, you have to come check out Ursuline's program. Tell us a little bit about the class itself. It's all online, I heard. Yes, it's a 18 credit graduate certificate. It's completely online. Six different courses. You take them in five week formats. So it's pretty intensive and exciting. And we have a lot of different faculty Im involved. And what can students expect to learn from this program? Why should they sign up? Students will learn the underlying theory of religion and ecology and sustainability and spirituality. They'll learn what leaders are doing across the planet and they'll identify their own leadership style and learn how to become leaders in their own community through practicum. So we do a lot of work in their own community and then they would bring that back to their coursework. And talking about community, I mean, right here, right here in Shaker Heights, Ohio, tell us a little bit about First Unitarian's approach to being sustainable and spiritual. Well, thank you. Um, we have a Unitarian Universalist Ministry for Earth group, and they have uh, done a lot to bring us to be what we call a green sanctuary. We went through an energy You got audit. that right. Yeah. <laughs> we went through an energy audit, uh, did a lot of work uh, looking at how, you know, whether we recycle, uh, what, it, what our light bulbs are, you know, all, all those energy kind of things. But what really happened that was cool, that was two kind of separate things, was the beginning of this permaculture garden and uh, uh, the gift, really, of our solar array. Um, we are a very kind of grassroots uh, oriented church so this is due really to the initiatives of uh, particularly a couple of our members here, Nancy King-Smith and Tom Gibson. Tom was the one who really got the permaculture garden going, arranged uh, for all the volunteers. This is all volunteer effort here. We, wow. We didn't uh, really hire anybody to do this. It was church people. And uh, the solar array was a very fortunate uh, eventual gift from Bold Alternatives. Uh, um, the guy who owns it is uh, related to the congregation here, and uh, they have put up the array. They maintain it. They sell us the electricity for 20% under uh, market rate. And when Good they, deal. It is a very good deal. I wish it for everyone. That's amazing. I mean, the permaculture garden, the solar array, we got this, you know, community garden. We have the rain collection. This is a prime example for you guys. So if you guys are willing to check it out, this sounds interesting to you. You're looking against sustainability and spirituality. You have to check out Ursuline's program and it's all online. So a couple clicks and you could be taking it, you know, right from your own computer. Well, thank you so much, guys. I really appreciate your time. Thanks a lot. Okay. Thank you. All right, guys, I'm Marty Bielef for CoolCleveland.com, and I'll see you online. Have a great one.